Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last year, back in October, I let you know that the Windows Phone Link app had lost the ability to allow you to remove your phone from the app. And I showed you a workaround. But quick recap, if we head into our settings, devices, yeah, you can see no option. It's been grayed out to remove your device, which caused a bit of a headache for a lot of users, as I've seen in the comments. Now, I'll leave that video linked, but the big problem with this was that if you use multiple phones connected with the same Microsoft account, obviously there comes a time where you may want to remove one of those devices. And the problem with this feature being removed is that you cannot remove your phones individually. So you must remove the account that connects both phones, as an example, and then you must manually set up everything again, which is a bit of a headache, as I mentioned. Now, I may have good news, and according to Windows Latest, the options are back to remove your phone. Now, I'm not seeing the option on any of my devices. So maybe it's region specific or on a controlled rollout or Microsoft is A-B testing it. But nonetheless, letting you know. Now, if we head over to an image or two provided by Windows Latest, here we can see on your mobile devices page in your settings app, at the bottom of that menu, you've got remove from account, which has recently been spotted by Windows Latest. So to put that into context, in Windows 11, if we head to our Settings app, Bluetooth and Devices, Mobile Devices, and you click on Manage Devices, give that a second or two to generate. Here at the bottom of these options, there now should be a Remove button to remove that device, which hopefully Microsoft is going to push out to more regions because this is actually a highly requested feature that Microsoft brings us back. So that just puts that into context. And then if we head to the next image provided, yeah, we can see if we zoom in, a remove button has been added once again to the devices page. So if we head back to the app, there should be now a remove button there as well, which I think is nice if you've got a phone maybe you're not using anymore or don't want linked, you can just remove it from there without having to remove the account that connects both phones as mentioned and then manually set up everything again, which is a bit of a headache as mentioned. So this is a highly requested feature and a lot of users, including myself, are actually wanting this to roll out to the phone link app and Windows again. But that's according to Windows latest. Let me know if you are seeing the option. I'd like to know how wide this rollout is or if Microsoft is A-B testing it. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.